boom hey guys welcome to the channel today who's a luke garage today's video we're going to be doing the uh, wheels it's june 7th right before i we washed uh, the vehicle for a different video and uh get a couple done today it's cloudy out uh, so it's a perfect time to do it it's 65 out for june it's kind of temperature is kind of low below average so we're, we're going to be cleaning the wheels and tires with the, Right here, brake buster by PNS. That stuff is good. I like it. I'm gonna have to buy an order a gallon of that stuff. That's pretty good. And then we're gonna be putting uh, on the tires grip gloss by Limitless Car Care. First time using tire it. dressing with glossy or matte finish. First time using it. So basically, of course, shake it well. Clean tires prior to use. And that's what we're gonna do. And then uh, with the Limitless Decon degreaser, we can use a degreaser, but I don't have it. I have to try it. Basically, uh, spray on use, spray on two tire, even covers to achieve wipe off overspray from rim with uh, limitless waterless wipe. I don't have that, guys. Sorry. And Grim Guard Grabber Microsoft towel. We'll just use a towel. And this has a different opening. Plus, they have a spray. Um, I'll probably just put on an applicator and, and save the spray. That's what we'll do. So basically, it's uh, no detail complete without cleaning your dressing tires. Grip gloss is a tire dressing that puts the finishing touch on a perfect detail. Grip gloss was carefully designed, superior protection. Let's see, to block UV rays from attacking rubber compounds in a tire. It's ideal for use on all tires. Can easily achieve a slick, shiny, or flat finish. So we'll try it out. And we'll see if we'll get any slink from it right here. It's out of New York. Alright, we're going to clean them with the um, Blake Brake Buster. And then we'll apply this on the wheels. Right there. You see the Brake, brake Buster just shine it, spray it all over the place. Works pretty good. Get in here. Should put on the wheels, tires. Get them nice and clean. I'm definitely. This stuff is good. Definitely gonna be getting a gallon of this stuff. Look at that. You can see it already working on the tires to get that um, oxidized off of that brown shit cleaning that stuff it's like a mold look at that it's already working pretty cool get your brush just work it in there and clean them all up we'll let the tires dry after I wash the vehicle and then we'll put the dressing on last get a couple videos done today what do you guys think what do you guys have a good day what do you guys do town on this week anything how's that weather where you guys at Dude, man, we just been getting tons of rain. It's crazy. It's like five days a week, you know? And then in between the rain, you're trying to do yard work. That's what we up to. Look at that. That's a, that's a pretty good job. That's just a tire. I like this stuff. All in one, too. You can't beat that. And I think a gallon of this stuff is only like $20. That's not on sale, you know? From Detailed Image. I'll have the link below for detailed engine. Another thing about detailed engine, detailed image is uh, I'll have a link too for a 10% off code if you use it. Uh, we get credit for store credit and that will help the channel out. So I appreciate it. I got my all my bucket, got enough stuff in here. Get in here. Clean them up. Of course, we're gonna have to. You can either jack the vehicle up or just pull it forward. You can do all the wheels. That's what I usually do. Or backwards. And then you can get in there. Get in there with your soft brush. Make sure your bristles are soft. Good, 
I have this other one too. So we'll get in there a little bit. I need to order them. Oh. Clean those bad boys up pretty good. What else we got? You can use one of these. I have one designated just for uh, wheels. Get in there real good. And we'll rinse her off. Look at that. Man, that does stuff clean great. You can also use it in your wheel wells, well. Wow, look at that. Plus two, this has a, a rust inhibitor on there for your, your rotors and spray it all over your calipers too to help it out. And once they dry, we'll look at it before we put it on there. Now I have to back the vehicle up. Look at that. That's pretty good. Kind of like beads on the wheels, don't it? A little bit. I definitely got to order a gallon of it so I can do stuff like the wheel wells and that. would be perfect for cleaning in there. Really would. All right, I'll get to going on the rest of them and uh, stay tuned. Mm. You can see what the vehicle looks like and then we'll drive it. And then I'll let you know in this video if it slings. So it might take a couple days to get this video done. We're going to put it on. Now that's from Limitless Tarcare Grip Gloss. And then it came with a spray bottle too. You can also spray it or you can use an applicator. We'll just do the applicator. And um, I was going to put it on the plastic. I don't know, but it kind of warmed up the sun. Fine. Ooh, this stuff is watery. Wow. Yeah. with that. Wow. Check it out. I wonder if it's most likely it's water based. It goes on. And probably better off to spread. Oh, oh, almost lost it. Ah, I got it. Hey man, that's in my car floor. Man, I scrubbed the heck out of these tires too. Keep getting that. Uh... That brown, it won't come out. It's like uh, oxidation turning brown, but it's probably the way the manufacturers is bleeding through all the time. So, oh well, not gonna get rid of it. Just keep cleaning it, putting a dressing on it. Stuff it looks pretty good. Might have to go over it a couple times, I like to say. Alright, check it out. Now, this stuff is shiny so far. We'll see if it flashes through this tire, and we'll uh, take a look at it. Let me do all of them, we'll let it flash, and we'll check them out. Grip gloss from Limitless Car Carolina Tires. Did the plastic too. Why not? Didn't use much product. Look. We're about right here. That's pretty good. It's pretty watery too. Did the plastic made the plastic look nice? I uh, missed a spot. Gotta get that. Missed a couple spots. But there's the tires. Um, still flashing. You can go over. It's real shiny. This stuff does shine up. So you're gonna get a you're gonna get a gloss look on this stuff. Right there. Definitely gonna have a gloss look. Here. It's still drying a little bit. It takes a little bit to flash. But uh, it looks pretty good. It's still wet, so it's probably going to take 15 20 minutes to let, that, uh, let it flash up. But yeah, I wouldn't drive it for about 15 minutes. But you're going to get definitely get a wet look on it. But it's a nice product. If you like shine and want it to be shiny, this is it. You're not gonna, I don't see it getting any lighter. Um, I don't know, I'll check in at about 20 minutes and see. But um, we'll drive it. I'll drive it for a couple days and then I'll, then I'll have my ending and see if it, we have any sling. 
and then so that way you guys will know because right now I don't know unless I drive it so we'll let it cure and then I'll drive it for a couple days and then we'll uh, come back and then finish that video then so it looks really nice on the plastic look at that looks really good how long is it gonna last probably not that long if it's raining who knows we'll see I don't think it's supposed to rain for a couple days anyway so I think we're good but, uh, yeah so far it looks pretty good I just missed a couple spots that's all let it flash then you can find the spots that you've missed all right so well keep watching and we'll find out uh, about if it slings and then we'll go over the product all right guys I'm gonna touch up a couple of spots that I may have missed and then we'll go from there what's your guys favorite tire dressing you know let us know in the comments also so that'd be cool yeah it looks good except for my willows I gotta clean that up I need to do a video on that and clean the heck out of that all right guys well the weight thing keeps looking good look at that I know it I'm after washing it with the hydro suds look at that wow looks good looks really good oh yeah two days since the grip gloss has been on the tires let me check it out looks good from I can see no sling on the door panels so you guys can see I did put it on the trim it does collect dust um, I think if it rained you can see here we had some moisture the other day at night you can see where it kind of ran off a little bit so I don't think it would last that long on a trim especially if it rained so I think probably the main use for this would be tires especially if you want a, a gloss look all right guys that's pretty much it a little update on this so I would say, yeah, works good if you want uh, tires to shine on your uh, vehicle. Limitless car care. So you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Later.